Yukon Huskies are the most dominant force in all of women's basketball. Watch as we break down their zone attack and how they flow into a traditional high post offense from four out transition. It's the ball side wing who will ultimately end up in the high post via the dribble handoff. After receiving the handoff, the wing reverses with the change pass across the top. As the ball swing, the wing cuts between the guards and settles into the high post. The first option for the high post is shot on the catch. With no shot available in the high post, the next option is the high-low pass to the player behind the zone. The Cincinnati guard is reluctant to cover down on the high post with Katie Lou Samuelson, a 47.8% three-point shooter looming at the top of the circle. Here the UCLA guard does not move on airtime of the pass, thus opening a passing window into the high post where UConn finds the high-low option once again. same handoff change pass cut into the high post and reversal Samuelson is at the top of the circle once again this draws a closeout that opens the high post for more high low action Here Cincinnati pinches with the forward to take away the high-low pass. With no shot and no high-low, UConn goes to the third option, the weak side feint. The Oklahoma defense takes away the shot, the high-low, and the weak side fan, but Kia Nurse forms a perfect triangle between two OU defenders for an inside-out three. possession here. The ball makes its way to the short corner. With no shot in the short corner, the rule is skip along the 45. The defense runs at Samuelson and she delivers the one more pass for an open look. Mm -hmm. 